now we have our SVG almost ready to go. We have to sort of think about what do we want to do with this in terms of how do we want to use this icon or um, image on our page. So what I'm thinking is, wouldn't it be cool if I can um, basically have this be two different shapes in React um, so that I could pass a fill color to the front or back card so that could potentially be you know, they could potentially be two different colors, like maybe this is a, a darker shade, something like that. So what I want to do to actually make these um, ready to be exported is a few things. The first thing that I want to do is I want to trim the white space around the artboard. So I'm going to go to Object, Artboards, Fit to Artwork Bounds. This is just going to make sure that when I actually export the, the SVG, there's no um, empty space around the bounds of the path. Now, I want to basically create two compound paths. One is going to be a path for the front card, and one is going to be a, a, a path for the back card. So I'm going to grab all of these elements of the front card. It's just the little, the little triangle in the A and the entirety of the card. Grab those two pieces. I'm going to go to Object, Compound Path, Make. Okay, click out of that. I'm going to click the back card now. Do the same thing, Object, Compound Path, make. So now I have two compound paths, which is exactly how I want to actually export the code of this. Um, so what I'm going to do in order to actually export this and get it ready to inject into my code is I'm going to go to File, Save As. Um, we can save it as whatever, it doesn't matter. We're, never, we're not actually going to save this out, so this, this step is not super important. What we care about is the next window here. So, okay, I have this set up, all good, right? What I care about here is SVG code. I'm gonna click that, it's gonna open a little notepad. Now notice, notice in here, so I have two paths, right? I have a path here and a path here. Now that is exactly what we want. That's why we created those two compound paths. So all we care about here all we care about here is everything between the opening and closing SVG tags. So we're going to copy all of that. Copy it all. And I have that on my clipboard and I'm going to go into my React project. And I have, um, I have a folder structure set up for this. So I have an icons folder. In that icon folder, I'm going to make a new folder. I'm going to call it dice. In that folder, I'm going to create a JavaScript file, I'll call it dice.js, and all this is going to be is just a functional React component. So I'm going to go through my normal um, sort of React component setup. I'm basically just going to paste everything that I copied in from the clipboard from Illustrator into here. I'm going to have to format this a little bit. I actually don't care about the style tags, so I can remove those completely. And I'm just gonna get this onto my page to see what we're working with, and we can kind of go from there. 